Did you know it's easier to buy a gun in Georgia than it is to vote? And that's not right. In Georgia, you can buy a gun in one day. And if the background check to determine whether you're a felon or not takes too long, you get the benefit of the doubt. If getting a gun were as difficult as voting, you'd have to register to purchase a gun 11 weeks in advance. And you would be limited to a short list of acceptable pieces of identification. If getting a gun were as difficult as voting, on gun pickup day, you would have to present two forms of identification to get access to your firearm. Republican legislatures around the country, including Georgia, have begun to pass laws in response to claims of voter fraud, saying that they want to restore confidence in the system. The Washington Post says that between 2020 and 2021, there were more than 250 voting bills proposed in 43 states, despite no widespread evidence of wrongdoing. There are opponents who say that the real purpose of the voting laws is to make it more difficult for black and brown people to vote. And while lawmakers have been focusing on ballot access, the U.S. has seen over 550 mass shootings so far in 2021, according to the Gun Violence Archive. Yet Congress still has not passed a federal law to protect Americans from gun violence. President Biden said it himself. He said they've offered plenty of thoughts and prayers, those members of Congress, but they've not passed a single new federal law to reduce gun violence. Enough prayers, it's time for action. It's almost as if some people value the constitutional right to carry a firearm more than their constitutional right to vote. Gun restrictions like background checks, waiting periods, prohibitions on certain gun types seem extreme to some. Yet, they consider school systems organizing active shooter drills for five and six-year-olds to be perfectly acceptable. If getting a gun were as difficult as voting, in some states, you could only purchase a gun on the first Tuesday in November. If getting a gun were as difficult as voting, you would have to wait in line at one specific gun place in your county and go to the wrong gun store on gun day and you will be turned away by law. If getting a gun were as difficult as voting, if there were a delay at your gun store during the previous gun buying period, the Secretary of State could move your gun location just weeks before your gun purchase date. If buying a gun were as difficult as voting, Georgia would be a safer place, but it's not. Confusing voting rules like those currently enacted in Georgia make it seem like someone is trying to make it difficult for people to exercise their constitutional rights to make a difference. Don't let them get away with it. Call your congressperson or your senator and tell them to support the For the People Act in Washington, which will create federal rules to expand voting rights. Oh, and while you're at it, tell them to vote for the John Lewis Voting Rights Act, which will require states like Georgia to get federal approval to change voting rules. Oh, and lastly, on the subject of guns, in 2021, a poll by Quinnipiac University showed that 89% of Americans support requiring background checks on all gun purchases. So what are the politicians waiting for? It's time that we, and our lawmakers got our priorities straight, like it or not. Okay, I'm a lawyer, so I gotta tell you, the ideas in this segment are mine and mine alone. They are not necessarily those of Fox 5 Atlanta or any of its employees. But I do wanna know if you like it or not. 